Okay, thanks guys. We're going to get started with the questions now. Okay, guys, we need to wrap this up now. No more questions. It is something very special indeed to make it to a UEFA Champions League final. Now, these two teams intent upon tasting glory. Welcome to the showpiece event on the European club calendar. Derek Ray here on the commentary position, joined tonight for live coverage by the former Arsenal and England fullback, Lee Dixon. It's Real Madrid taking on Liverpool. Good evening, what a pleasure it is to be here with you, Derek, sitting over this magnificent stadium with arguably the best two teams, well, obviously the best two teams in this competition this year, because they're in the final. And what a final we've got. The pitch looks fantastic. The crowd are expecting. There's the trophy just sitting there and the players in the tunnel just about to do what they do best, go out and play and entertain us. dissect the Real Madrid side and they are a team Lee known for their aggressive high pressing well absolutely that takes a lot of hard work a lot of organization force the opposition to make early passes the weakness of it if you beat the high press you can get exposed in the back it is the game that the world truly focuses on the Champions League final only two teams left in the quest for European glory. Who's it going to be tonight, Lee? Well, it's a toss of a coin for me. It's a really big night for everybody. All that hard work leading up to pre-season training, going through your domestic league, playing Champions League on and off, the winter break, all of that culminates in tonight. Very, very big night for everybody concerned, supporters, but most so the players. They have to stay focused, play the game, not the occasion. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting 11. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander Arnold in the fullback positions. Thiago starts with Jordan Henderson in the centre of the pitch. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. They've lost it. Well, they could run onto it here. And in with a real chance. A goal it is, the first important statement in this final, made by Liverpool. Well, we've got the biggest club competition in the world, and now we've got our first goal. Well, here's the replay, and the ball over the top is an absolute beauty. And once he gets himself settled with the keeper to beat, he hammers it into the back of the net. Smashing goal. Carvajal, surely, and begging to be put away, and a goal, the keeper couldn't stop it, Real Madrid on terms. Well, as we see again, that's how to score goals, get the ball into the box from wide areas, and then through on goal, do you go for placement or do you go for power? 
Well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? Absolutely smashes it past the keeper. It's with Roberto Firmino. Not a decent position for Liverpool to be in. Pulls it back. And they nudge in front. Well, fabulous celebrations. They've got their noses in front, Derek. Can they stay there? Well, here's the replay. That pullback cross is so hard to defend against. And that eventually leads to what amounts to a simple task of rounding the goalkeeper. 2v1. There's only one winner. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. This attack looks highly promising. Thumped clear. No nonsense clearance. And will it be the leveller? And a goal! And what an important goal in the grand scheme of things! Well, it's the sort of determination and desire that's got them here. All the momentum is with them now. Well, here's the replay. It's a really lovely through ball. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him. Gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. It's with Fabinho. Well, pass after pass. Maybe they can chisel an opportunity. He's in here. Has eyes for goal. Here we can take another look at it. You've got to ask questions about the keeper's positioning. That's half of his job. You can put the best keeper in the world wrong side of the goal, he won't save anything. How about this? England's most successful European club have done it again. Liverpool, the winners of the Champions League. Well, some might say back to where they belong. An absolutely brilliant night capped off with winning the trophy commiserations for their opposition but at the moment it's all about celebration for those boys yeah that is precisely what they intend to do Lee celebrate long into the evening Liverpool the victors and now as a player and in this case as a Liverpool player You've got to prepare yourself for the trophy lift. Well, yeah, this is where you want to be the captain. Sometimes it's a hindrance because everybody's looking at you for a bit of inspiration. But you get to do this. You get to pick up this magnificent trophy and celebrate with your teammates. Liverpool this year have painted Europe red. It's official now. The kings of European club football. Liverpool. Well, certainly the red half of Liverpool and Merseyside will be celebrating tonight. Not so sure about the Everton fans, but even they might celebrate a little bit. And this is really special, getting to celebrate in front of your own fans. Well, it's giving something back. These fans have travelled all over the place following their team. Now they get to join in the celebrations, go into the crowd and give them the cup. That's what I say. Well, then it might never find its way to the trophy cabinet, Lee. Well, they've come together in this competition as a team and they're celebrating together now, fully deserved. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe. Just a moment of your time.
Yeah, no further questions, thanks.